The busy factory floor at American Surplus in Montevideo can barely keep up with demand as they usher in a new era of ice fishing. The days of fishing out of the old uh, wooden boxes are over. Um, there's still th time and place for that, but um, we've taken a step further. Ice fishing I'm a, has been a part of Minnesota culture for many, many years. Um, started out with the shacks and the shanties and the, and the villages that you've seen, you know, like in the movie Fargo. An ice castle is a, they call it a portable fish house on wheels. Um, we take them out ice fishing, obviously, in the winter time, drill holes in the lake, catch fish. In the summertime, people use them for camping. Um, in the fall, they use them as a hunting shack, overflow at their cabin. We were making storage shed before, and then we got a call from uh, our dealer up in Black on Clean Freight to uh, build a fish house. So we built one, and it was sold before it even got up there, and that's where it all started. We had no idea that ice fishing, ice castle, would become what it is today. I mean, it's, it's crazy. We built uh, 2,100 last year. Now I think we're on pace to build 2,500 this year, so it's nuts. The noise, you know, and the, and the, the activity in the shop is, I, I refer to it as uh, like a beehive. There's a lot of people running around, uh, very busy. Um, everybody has a certain job that they're specialized in, and they, they do a fantastic job of getting it done. Like I say, they're specialized in it. They do 10 of them a day. Um, the noise gets up there. The decibel level is pretty high with uh, a lot of saws and compressors running and nail guns and everything like that. It's a very, very busy place. To get certified to be an RV, we had to apply with uh, RVIA, the Recreational Vehicle Industry Association, um, which means we have to follow certain codes, certain safety codes, um, window size, that type of thing. Having that RVI certification has definitely been a benefit for our business. Um, our business has quadrupled since then. And that ability to be able to go into campgrounds and to be considered an RV, and also to be financed like an RV, um, that opened up a whole new world for us to get that certification. What's so special about an ice castle? Well, let's take a look inside. This is our 8x16 signature series. It's one of the top of the line ones. So we have cedar interior, it's tongue and groove cedar interior. Um, this one has comes equipped with a boat seat, it's got skylights, LED lighting, satellite dish, stove, microwave, sleeping for five. This folds down into a bed, there's storage down here, plenty of storage in these cabinets. Um, we're famous for the camo interiors, <laughs> the ladies like that a lot. Um, this one comes equipped with a, a little bathroom area. We, of course, use the bucket method, so at least you have some sort of privacy. Well, we just had our first fishing contest, the Ice Castle Classic. It turned out very well. We had over 3,200 people, so looking forward to next year's, getting in uh, more vendors. Should be, should be a success. fish was a 16 pound buffalo carp. There was only five fish caught, we had 50 prizes, um, so we just did a drawing for the, for the rest of the prizes. We did give away all of the prizes that we um, promised people we would. It, it was nice, it was nice. A, a lot of the response I got 
to having it here on our home lake was, um, you know, it's about time to have something local, something close to home. Um, local, you know, a lot of our local people like to ice fish. If you go out to Lac of Parle, there's all kinds of little dotted villages out there. So it was nice to have something close to home in southwestern Minnesota. I really enjoy, it's important to me, I really enjoy my job. Um, I, I use the product. I have an ice castle. I've had three of them now. Um, it's a lot of fun. It's something new every day. Um, we keep a lot of people employed in this area. Um, this is a, a, a one of we're one of the larger employers in the area. I think that's very important for rural Minnesota to have um, companies like ours out here. Working for the company, you know, it really fits my lifestyle. It's what my hobbies are, myself and my family. Like I said, we're big into fishing. We, we love fishing and outdoors. Um, that's a perfect fit. I love working with my family. You know, it's not a, you know I get to see my dad every day. Long hours though, long hours, but I don't mind it, it's, it's fun.